hello good viewers you are hello welcome uh, into this tutorial we are going to be solving this world challenge problem <laughs> so now from here we are given this root of x plus 2 equals minus x so what the value of x so now some people said this will not give us real solution because this left hand side is equal to the uh, negative x and this root x plus 2 cannot give a negative number so for the fact that we have minus x here which is negative so therefore we don't have a solution so now we truly have solution okay so we will not have solution if the right hand side is just ordinary constant right like one two three right but you know that if we have this x x is, your, is just a variable but if you have this x to be we have the x to be a negative number let's say like minus one minus two minus three so you see that the minus will cancel the minus then you're going to have positive all right so therefore what we're going to do now is that let's try to look at the domain the domain of this uh, equation okay so let me use at uh, this right hand side let's take this right hand uh, right hand side first so this x must be what x must be zero i mean must be less than zero if we must consider the real solution so x must be less than zero then let's look at this left hand side the left hand side for the left hand side so here the x plus 2 must be greater than 0 so now this inside the radical sign must be what must be greater than 0 before we can have a real solution so therefore we're going to have a interval okay of the solution to be between when x is greater you know when s is when x plus 2 is greater than 0 so this implies that x equals or x is greater than minus 2 so therefore we're going to have s greater than minus 2 and s less than 0 so this is what this is the interval we have the interval this is the interval so therefore we are going to have a solution between this minus 2 and 0 where the minus 2 and 0 are not what are not uh included in the solution so we move further from there so we are going to have x plus 2 okay equals minus what minus x so now to get rid of this radical sign we're going to square the both sides right so now squaring the both sides this we cancel this we have x plus 2 equals then this will be x square this power 2 we neutralize this uh, negative that is we are going to have positive now so we are going to rearrange this x2 minus x minus 2 equals 0 so we have quadratic equation so now from here having this quadratic equation we're going to factorize this in this form we have x here we have x here equals 0 so now from here we look for the two uh, factors of minus 2 that is when you multiply them together you're going to have minus 2 but when you add them together you're going to have this one at the middle so what are we going to do we're going to have this to be minus 2 plus 1 so minus 2 plus 1 if you if you have minus 2 times plus 1 we're going to have minus 2 then minus 2 plus plus 1 we're going to have minus so we have the solution to be x minus 2 equals zero because this is zero form equation or we said x plus one equals zero so now from here so we transpose minus two to the other side we're going to have x to be equals minus two then we are going to have plus two rather sorry we have x to be two and here we have x to be minus one so now let's look at the value of x now so we don't need to disturb ourselves let's go and look at the interval of solution so now or we look at the domain we have here so our domain say x must be greater than minus 2 and what and must be less than 0 so therefore 
let's look at the two solutions we have we have x equals to 2 here so which is not part of the sort it's not it doesn't belong towards to the set or to the domain so therefore this x equals to 2 will be rejected we have to reject it then when you look at x equals 1 so let's look at x is equal to 1 is it part of the solution yes it's part of the interval so therefore we're going to pick x equals 1 to be our solution right so now if you want to check now and see whether we are right or not so we're going to have we do actually we don't need to check again because this has been uh, cleared enough because we've stated and uh, we've stated our domain okay from the beginning so now having this has really shown that we have our solution but nonetheless we can still check we have x plus 2 equals minus x so the root of x we said x to be what x to be minus 1 plus we have 2 equals minus minus 1 right so here is going to be minus 2 plus 1 we're going to have 1 okay this is going to give us 1 the square root of 1 is 1 equals 1 so and that is the solution right so therefore we have x minus 1 to be the solution the real solution here so thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed the class kindly you know share this class to your colleagues and if you have not subscribed to our youtube channel consider subscribing today so that you'll be notified anytime we upload a new content thank you bye, -bye.